let's talk about solitaire card games. Now, everyone, everyone knows what solitaire is. But just in case, let's talk about the elements of a solitaire card game. Solitaire card games have a deck, also known as the stockpile, and most versions have a waste pile, which is where you turn the cards over. You know, for instance, in the typical solitaire game, you would turn over one at a time or three at a time. In addition to the waste pile, there are the foundations, and most solitaire games have between one and eight foundations. And lastly, there's the tableau. And the tableau in solitaire, in the typical solitaire game, is the space where you have the stack of one face up card, and then one face down and one face up, two face down, one face up, so on. And the way the game works is, of course, your object is to move an ace up to one of the four foundation piles, turn over the next card on the tableau, and play on. Now, that's typical solitaire. So we have deck or stockpile, waste, tableau, foundations. This is called Klondike. If someone says to you, I want to play solitaire, they probably mean Klondike. There's another version. It's got some similarities. And then it's got its own thing. It's called golf. And the difference in golf is that it has a stockpile. It doesn't really have a waste pile. It has seven rows for the tableau, seven columns, but each one is dealt, each card on the tableau is dealt face up, and then you're playing down to one foundation. The foundation, if you want to think that this game has a waste pile, it's the same as the foundation. You turn a card over, and then you play onto the waste pile slash foundation. Now that's golf. There's another game that is different from these two in many ways. It's called Clock. And the reason it's called Clock, as you shall see, is it's dealt out like the face of a clock. You go one, two, three o'clock, four o'clock rock, right? And then there's six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And so you've got 12 spots around the clock. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. And then you've got one in the middle. To make 13. And you go around again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And you do this until the deck is expended, just like this. And what you have is, think of the four cards in the middle as your stockpile, and then each of the 12 spaces on the face of the clock as your tableau. There is no real waste pile. And the foundation is built like this. I turn over a card in the middle. It's an eight. I pull it over to the corresponding spot on the face of the clock, which is over here, eight o'clock. So this is tableau, this is foundation. If I put the eight here, then I turn over this card. When you reach a king, your turn is done. It goes here. And then you turn over a card here, and you put it to, in the corresponding spot on the table, the face of the clock, that equals that value. That was a five, so I put it there. 
There's a seven, seven o'clock. There's a queen. Queen is 12 o'clock, noon or midnight. Nine, that goes with nine o'clock, and so on. You go until you've seen all four kings. And if you can empty the face of the clock, no more face down cards before you see the last king, then you win the game. So as you see, there are many different ways to play solitaire. We just talked about very unique games. There are dozens upon dozens. You could probably invent your own.